Alright, what's up guys, and welcome against a really really proper opponent in Chuck. Oh, pure ugly, that's... that ought to be enough. <laughs> Formadan due to steel and bug type actually posed somewhat of a threat towards me. I do believe I deal with shot out with potting shot and potentially boom burst, and Mr. Mime is never pretty. We've already knew that. Can I assume it's scarfed or is it just a screener? Why not both? Because why would you? You turn on this and bring in my Metagross. <coughs> Should be an easy way of scaring it out. Even though I don't enjoy Warmadan. Yeah, that's a nice chunk. Really hope this is a more offensive variant. Right, Metagross should be the switching. Because he should go for stabs, I think. Would be very risky going for Shadow Ball. Charge Beam. Technician! It's fair enough. Oh no. Knew it. <clears throat> Life Orb. Somehow that's worse, right? Pull a punch on this. He's gotta switch out. Didn't. Nice. I'll take it. Um, that's not technician boosted though, is it? That's, yeah, it is. It's 50 base power. Yeah, fine. Fair enough. Um, if Warmaran comes in, I need to just send him my spinner ASAP. Muru Muru. Oh, yeah, this guy. He knows what's up. Sandfalls. By the way, for anybody wonder, Sandfalls is like a really cool set with this. Um, mainly because you can actually combine, combine it with Dranzar and a choice bandit he found on. Which is just really, really scary. So you're gonna go for Cuz. Yeah, told you, Sandfalls. He could have Crunch too. That's never pretty. And if so, I do believe he wins this matchup. Should be scared at first crunch, but the second one definitely. I was half expecting stealth rocks. <laughs> I was expecting stealth rocks for sure. Let's see, ah, solid. Stone Edge? No, that's not gonna do it. The only positive trait he got versus me specifically now is that he can slack off the damage. I don't believe I have uh, like the mid specs of trying to kill it, though I do believe he can switch in Warmadan to reposition himself. And Warmadan can have Quiver Dance, and if so, I got all kinds of trouble. Let's see, Pink Poo, yeah. <clears throat> About that. I'll say. Getting frozen? Nope. That would have been nice. Alright. See leftovers, that's kinda good. I know what I gotta do. Right? Yeah. This is it. Like, in theory, if it's Quiver Dance, I'm still kind of a rough position. I should be able to soak one hit. But I'm pretty sure this should be Stealth Rock. Bug was. Nope. Resisted. Still does a lot. That isn't helping. We do have speed, though, so we should be able to KO him. But I'm clearly not standing against you no know, offensive threats. That did a whole lot, though. Did he have a ghost? I can't remember. And at this point, I probably can't risk it either. Take him out, buddy. <laughs> yeah, I, I do believe um, my worst part or like scenario here is that it brings in um, the pure oily. I think facade together with U-turn is just enough to make me a very sad man. Okay. Moss. Oh yeah. That's an ugly motherfucker. Yeah, you know exactly what I was about to say. Um, the thing is, 
it gets knockoff. So it's not like a really fun mom to deal with. I do believe I can bring in Sabrax and um, like take the fake out. He can easily U turn. I don't believe he's gonna do that. Oh my god, he has hypnosis. I'm not gonna say that's greedy, that's fantastic. Never consider it because 60% is, after all, not that pretty. <laughs> but he switches out. Muru Muru. Alright, we need to connect his hit, buddy. I have expecting him to die to this. School buddy! <sighs> there is no way he outspeed though, right? He had curse. I am banking on these 90% right now. Oh, come on! Damn it! Ah, shame. Well, GD Shuck. Bit sad you didn't want to play with me. Anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed this game, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Till then, take care, one right?